morning, welcome. This is day two, lovely sunny Sunday morning on our uh, Cornwall trip. And we're heading down to the Lizard today. Uh, never been there. Interested to take a look. It's an all day in Cornwall job today. Once I finish faffing. Right, looks like tour leader's ready. In fact, everybody's ready. Yeah, nice breakfast. Size of the rear tire. Holy crap! Massive rear tire. <laughs> Probably handle like a pig. A few bikes out this morning. Very careful that mini, that white mini is really on your tail. I should give you guys a chance to get a couple cars through the head, not a lot of them. Traffic down here, even out of school holidays, is pretty crap. There's only one sort of one or two main drags down to the bottom of Cornwall. Everything's on them, isn't it? And back. <laughs> Some slightly uh, hatchings overtaking, but. Just a solid queue in it all the way down. That's it. Well, oh guys, I turn my camera back on now. We've got through some traffic and uh, we're into a slightly uh, more scenic area now on the way down to the uh, more southerly point. Heathrow in front of me. And Kim's behind on the Bonneville. A bit cloudier up here. Hope it don't rain because I've not bought any rain gear with me. Rain's not on the cards today. Parham. Parham Worthel. There's some oddly named places down there, kind of a mixture of Gaelic and Cornish. Does anybody actually speak Cornish down there? That's a good view up here. Really open, really. Really see a long way now. Definitely got colder, it's dropped to 10 now. It's not paddling weather. So I went paddling with my boots on yesterday. It didn't feel too cold. Oh, it's glorious to get a bit of speed up without traffic around. Still sculptures for sale back there. We want to do a Top Gear challenge, and each of us has to buy the <laughs> the the other person a uh, 
still scorched to get home on the motorbike. Lizard, four and a half miles. Chocolate factory. We missed it. So after that breakfast, I don't think I can fancy much chocolate. There'll be a lighthouse over there, isn't it? Definitely see you this evening. Watch the gravel, I think. Name of the game. Finally, his GS is coming into its own. <laughs> yeah! Oh, you got all helmet hair. Helmet hair, I get three ridges. <laughs> well, we've made it. There we are. You go in front of me, just be careful you don't spin the tyre upon that. Get it rolling and keep rolling. It's a nice place to stop for a coffee anyway. A lot of people there with the bird, wa bird watching uh, glasses, spy glasses, weren't they? Mm. Looks boring, doesn't it? Looks nearly as boring as fishing. I mean, it's okay when you found your bird, but you could be out hanging around half a day looking at nothing. clearer inland actually doesn't it this cloud just seems to be hanging over the bay here well, that's nice it's getting out of the way now I'm gonna have a bit of a bit of a run along the lanes Almost joyful when you can get a run like this, isn't it? There's so much traffic. Oh, you definitely catch so much up, don't you? Well, 
live in three quarters of a mile. Nearly there. God, look at all the cars parked in that field up there. Look, I wonder what's happening there. Levin. Well, it's Porth Levin, isn't it? Not Port Levin. Porth Levin. Looks like we're getting down to the arbor. Pasties. Shut there. Mm, well, I shall be guarding it if we do. Might go for something a bit lighter actually. Do give you uh, indigestion if you're not careful, I think. Cycles for a dedicated bay. Let me get us all in there. This is Port Levin, Port Levin. Lovely harbour. And Heath. <laughs> Where's the other two gone? Uh, can you tell me about the church then, Carol? Nothing. Faffing, faffing, faffing. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, does this filming work? Such a lot of faffage. Port Levin, Port Levin is a lovely place. The crab sandwich was lovely. And it's warming up as well. I mean the bike says 28 degrees, that I don't believe. It's probably about 12. As soon as I open my eyes, it flies in. Yeah, it's steaming up a bit on that hot. What is he doing? Like he's lost something in the ditch. So, 82 miles back to base. Oop, turning. towards Helston. How come we always seem to be heading towards a big black cloud? That seems to be permanent for today, that does, doesn't it? Ooh. I'm 
not to escort a state. Not many of those haven't rotted away by now. You realise we've not had a Cornish cream tea? And I have not had a cake on this tour. So no cake, no Cornish cream tea. We're slipping. How can we be called <laughs> bike tours with cake? I uh, know, this is a private tour isn't it? I forgot about that. This is not an official bike tours with cake tour. This is an unofficial splinter group tour. I think we did go to St. Tyres from Pro Sons, yeah. Oh, I got him, I got him, don't worry. Oh, why didn't he just take his? Slowed right down and then flashed his lights for me to come over. Why don't they just take the right of way? I don't know. Don't know. Didn't put me under. I'm sorry, but I know he thinks he's being. Just, just drive no, your normal drive. I mean, where he had stopped, if someone come around that corner, they'd been into the back of him. And then he parted to an accident. always nice to see isn't it twisty signs Round nice, isn't it? Well, there's another uh, disused tin mine here. And you can see the sea again. You could easily cut that junction up, couldn't you, by going over it really fast. What were you doing there? <laughs> what were you doing? <laughs> I thought you were heading for the hedgerow in a minute. Yeah, slow manoeuvring, yeah. Again, it looks like we're in a ditch, doesn't it? Yeah, I know, it's like... They love building roads in the bottom of ditch bottoms, don't they? Devon and Cornwall. I don't know. When you meet somebody, there's nowhere to go either. Oh, nearly had another bird. It is very cool, yes. Cornish pasty key ring. Momento of uh, yesterday. I'll always be reminded. Wonder if he's getting any ear rape from behind. This is a farm track. <laughs> No, 
to see if he got me actually. Where'd she go? I can't see you now. No, she's there. She's there. <laughs> we got grass down in the middle. Guys are heading back to uh, a base in Plymouth. It's the end of two great days riding down here in the southwest. Um, it wouldn't probably be the ideal bikers' destination because some of these roads do get really crowded. Uh, the holiday makers all searching out uh, sun, sea, and sand, and uh, the, the roads do get uh, get busy. But it's still worth seeing. It's certainly an area that we've not been to before, and uh, I'm really grateful of our friends here have uh, put us up and shown us around. Really grateful. I'm going to sign off now, but if you do enjoy watching the videos, if you like to subscribe, I'd really appreciate the sub. Uh, if you really enjoy them and you want to be notified when I post every video, click the little bell icon and it'll come up in your notifications when I post the next video. I do all sorts of videos, it's mainly touring but I do product reviews, kit reviews and uh, we've got some uh, big tours coming up so keep a look out on the channel and thanks a lot for watching again and I'll catch you later. Cheers!